Okay, so I'm almost done with this page. Uh, I just need to add, like, the rest of this background. Um, the stripes on Princess's dress. Effects right here. And then, like, the table. Um, fucking... Even the most basic comic pages, I swear to God, does take me 40 years. <sighs> It's mostly because of this shit. Like, this looks, like, pretty simple, right? But, like, check this shit out. It's like... I put a lot of effort into stuff that no one sees. <laughs> okay, I finished this page. Um, it's about... It's almost 6 o'clock in the morning, so I'm about to go on a morning walk. Um, the evening walks are okay, but... Um, I find that my energy is super low um, towards about 7 o'clock to the point where like I'm falling asleep at my desk if I do the evening walks. Um, and even though I hate doing it in the morning because like it's scary, it's it's honestly like if I do it at 6.30 it's still, it's getting light outside so I don't have to worry about it like too much. It's like when I go 5.30 it's that's too early so it's like I gotta time it just right um but yeah I got uh I, I downloaded some new like uh brushes so I have like these uh manga brushes that help me do speed lines um I know that everybody is like saying like Holly just fucking use Clip Studio Paint I already pay for Adobe dude like I have to like I use it for everything um uh, so I, I don't really have the option to, like, not pay for Adobe, so I'm going to use the software that I pay for, and, yeah. <laughs> so, um, plus I'm just used to it, so. I know, I know Manga Studio or Clip Studio Paint has all the stuff, but whatever. I mean, I'm just gonna be, like, an old grandpa and just use Photoshop, okay? <laughs> I'm so annoyed with myself. I accidentally deleted the footage of the Harry Potter stamps. It's fine. I just want to die because I... I'm so mad. I, I'm i still going to find a way to, to use this in something, in some kind of video, but whatever. Uh, that's annoying because I really wanted to make a fucking video about it, but whatever. I guess I'll die. Um... What I might do is use some of these because I want to engrave on macaroons, which sounds kind of dumb. Um, but I bought these little boxes for, basically, I just want to send, like, little gifts to my friends. And I think, like, little macaroons would be perfect. Um, so I want to do some Halloween ones, and I want to do also do just, like, whatever the hell I feel like ones. Just because, like, I've never engraved on them. Um... So, yeah. Macaroons are really expensive, though, so I'm, I'm not giving them a lot <laughs> because they're expensive. They're like $2 a cookie, dude. And I could make them, but, <sighs> dude, macaroons are kind of a pain in the ass, and uh, they usually take me like three hours at least, and I don't want to try to go to fucking Whole Foods to get fucking almond flour, so, eh. Okay. Espresso, please. Um... So here is generally, I haven't sanded these, so this is just me like testing shit out to see like how it would look. Um, and also, I don't really like these two prints that I made. So I'm, I changed them to have a thicker outline. Because sometimes when you uh, scale things down for laser, laser stuff, um, I'm scared to make it like too thick. So sometimes I have to do, like, test prints to see, like, how it looks. Um, so anyways, I am going to sand these, and um, if you guys want one of these mess-up ones, I guess I'll just, like, do a giveaway in the comments, I guess. So two people who want uh, one of these, let me know. Um, and I guess I'll just, I'll do it based off of... Um, whoever comments first because I can see who comments first so whoever like comments and then um so contact uh, I'll hold on I'll I guess let me think of like how you could contact me I'll leave I'll leave my email no 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 I can't do that I'll comment after your comment with my email 
to say that you got it, okay? That way, okay, good, good. We figured it out. Anyways, um, so basically this is kind of what I want to do for all October. I want to make a print every day, a five by seven print every day. Um, and these will go on my laser store. Um, and then I will make a zine of them that will go on my main store. Now there's gonna be a theme, so what I'm making right now is just more of like whatever the hell I want in terms of prints, but like I'm going to make it a, a theme. I haven't decided on a theme yet um, because it's just hard, dude. Um, but yeah, these are the wood prints. Um, uh, I, I like the five by seven because it's just like, it's small, it's cheap. Um, and what I'm trying to decide on is uh, to have an option where people can just like it. It won't cost extra because I don't think it's like really worth it to to charge extra. But like um, basically to engrave on the back so that they could make it into a postcard. Um, because a lot of people actually that's what they do when they have like laser businesses is they do like postcard printing like wood postcards this is a crazy thick postcard but technically this counts as letter mail which is whack to me but yeah you could literally mail this um, some people just like it for like the gimmick of like it looking like a postcard but anyways um, uh, this was what uh, I, I really like the, uh, the idea of like I don't know, doing something like this because, um, you know, I, I, in general, I don't really like prints unless they're fancy schmancy. Um, I've experimented with doing prints in the past and I just have found that like smaller prints, I think are the way to go when it comes to the laser stuff and, um, they look really cool. Uh, but, uh, these are the messed up ones, and I will sand them and make them look nice. But anyways, the point I was trying to say is that, like, shipping these will also be easy because I can ship them in a flat mailer. Um, so, yeah, it, it won't, it won't, I, this can be, uh, parcel, which is, like, significantly cheaper than priority mail. Um, it still has tracking, it's just, like, not, uh, two-day shipping. Uh, but, yeah. Look at this deer. It's got like a messed up antler. You see? How one of them is like down. What'd you do, baby? Right, so I bought these bagels today. And like, maybe I'm just being a psychopath right now, but like, the serving size is three bagels. And I'm just like, whoever did the nutrition facts on this is fucking stupid. Like... The point of mini bagels is that you have one of them. Why is the serving size three? Like, I don't under Like, why would you make it like that? So I have to do math every time I want to, like, know what I'm actually eating? Like, that's really dumb. I don't under- Like, I hate that. I hate- I hate stupid shit like this because these are, like- These are clearly meant for you to eat, like, a smaller bagel. So, I, I maybe I'm psycho, maybe I'm stupid, but that is literally the dumbest shit ever. I found a hidden trail. I cut through, like, this, uh, dense area in the park that looked like it was, it honestly looked like farming. So, I hope I didn't trespass yet again. Uh, but I think I'm still in the park. Um, but, uh, yeah, I like how, I like these kinds of trails where you're up high. Makes me feel tall. What's this here? Is it a dillo? Rikey, mate, that's a dillo. Ah, shit, ah, there it goes. There it goes, there it goes. There it goes. Ah. I spooked him. Bye. Look at this jackass in front of me. What a fucking cunt. Just use a fucking bumper sticker like everybody else, you stupid ass. Now I can't fucking see you when I fucking drive, dumb cunt. It's raining. 
I was gonna go on a walk today, but now it's like, even if the rain stops in time, it's gonna be so fucking muddy that I'm kind of just like, fuck it. Um, plus I have shit I have to do because tomorrow I have a farmer's market if it doesn't rain out. Um, so I kind of have to like prepare for that. Um, but I got a lot of other shit I have to do today. Like I have to go to Lowe's, which I don't want to do, but I have to do. <sighs> I woke up early today to walk and I just, I don't know. Sometimes the days after I do like more than 20K steps, I feel super tired. And today was just like one of those. So, ugh, I want to do it every day. That's kind of the point. So I'm kind of just like, Mentally conflicted. <laughs> Why are you on the fridge? I'm not getting you down. You got yourself into this mess. You can get down. Yeah. Why are you on the fridge for? Get down. Want to walk? Um, apparently they closed the parks during, uh, Labor Day weekend, and they're doing it all the way through till Tuesday, and I'm just like, what the fuck? It's so stupid. Now, I don't know how they're going to enforce closing the parks, because all they really did was, like, basically they just put a lock on the main gate. Um, so me, like, apparently seven other people just parked in front of the gate <laughs> and we're like fuck it uh so maybe i might get a fine for going on a walk today i don't know i understand why they want to do it because labor day weekend a lot of families would come and probably have a barbecue and like <laughs> even though they never go to the park ever except for the holidays i get it i understand it's just like one of those things where i'm like why can't you just, instead of closing the park, just say, uh, enter at your own risk, social dis dis distancing, stuff like that. Like, the park, for me, is, like, how I get exercise. You can't ban people from getting exercise. And I'm not, like, a cra like, I am a firm believer in social distancing and wearing a mask and stuff. But, like, you know, I just, I don't really like the idea of closing parks when like this is this is how I get exercise dude like you're not gonna you're not gonna fucking stop me from going to the fucking park <laughs> so I doubt that they'll do anything because there's so few people in here like there's literally like max probably 10 people at the park <laughs> so like and this is a big ass park um technically this leads into like four other parks so I could have like drove uh, to uh, Salado Creek and just parked there um, and got in really easily, but I like this entrance better because this is closer to my house. Um, even though I walk all the way over there, it doesn't, you know, whatever. Um, but yes, um, this is what I was talking about, by the way, was like, I'm not sure if it's like farming or whatnot. Or if it's just like a really weird plant that I'm not aware of. So if you guys uh, know what this plant is, let me know. Is this like, I can't tell what it is at all. Like, I don't know. Come here, little guy. Come here. I know you see me. Come here. Come here, little buddy. Yeah. Come on over to the wild side. To Holly's table. Holy shit, are you actually doing it? Come here. Come here. Where'd you go? You little buddy. What's going on? Oh. You didn't like me too much? Can I pet you? Can you come back? No? Aw, oh, damn it. Okay. So I figured out how you can put images on wood. Uh, basically, it's like a method where you use like a uh, polyacrylic and a laser printer. 
um, I really like the results and I want to try to make um, wood charms, like printed wood charms out of this method. I fucked up here and here because I scrubbed off the paper a little too hard. Um, but I like the result. Like, it looks really cool. And I think it would be really neat to have, like, art prints like that. So I was thinking, like, oh, man, wouldn't it be cool to have, like, 11 by 17 prints that are, like, really big and, like, wood? <laughs> it, I just thought it would be really cool. So I was like, oh, man. So what I might do is I might, like, order from Cat Print. Because I know cat print is a laser print, so I'm kind of curious to see, like, if it would work with cat print stuff. Because um, basically, I would get, like, the thinnest paper stock that they have, and then try the method myself. And if it doesn't work, well, I guess I'm fogged, and then I guess I wasted money. But, because you have to do the image reversed, which I didn't do on this, because this is my icon, and I was just like, fuck it. You're supposed to do the image reversed, and I didn't do that, but, like, yeah, I don't know. I think it would be kind of cool to have art prints like that, but, yeah, I've had a lot of people ask me about art prints. Pig, seriously? I keep forgetting to, like, actually film my face because I, I just don't fucking do it. Um... I have a vlog camera and I like never use my vlog camera. I'm using my phone. Like I literally have a designated camera and I never use it. Um, yeah, my hair looks like shit today because it rained and I went outside to check the mail when it was raining. Um, and my hair will immediately curl if you get it wet. So it's just like the shittiest straightened job ever because <laughs> it's like there's chunks where it's kind of straight. But um Sorry that I, I like never show my face. I just, I just kind of forget. So I feel like ass because I fucking ate three bagels, <laughs> three of those mini bagels. I know why they serving size at three now, but I don't know how people do that because oof, oof. It was a mistake. I really shouldn't have had that many bagels, but whatever. <laughs> um, but, uh, what have I been doing? Well, I've been trying to plan for several videos because basically I want to get this stuff ready to like make these laser videos. Um, and I just, I keep running into a lot of problems with like the laser videos. Um, so let me just show you. Okay. So we established that I'm trying to like get the laser printing onto wood. And I thought for a while that I could make it big. I don't think so. It'd be too difficult to do like a, a large print that way. So then I was thinking like, why couldn't I just like get like a sticker and essentially just like use a sticker and then like coat it. Um, so this was like that attempt. Uh, and then I like fucked it up right here because I, I didn't notice paper sticking to it, but whatever. Like right here, you can kind of see that it looks okay. It's not perfect and it's also not cut very well. Um, but like I literally like didn't even remotely try to match it up at all. Um, so I was like, that kind of works, but it would probably be better if I had um, resin to coat it so that it's permanently on there because it's not really like permanent. I also was thinking like, well, if you're using a sticker, couldn't you use like a clear sticker to do this so that you don't have as many problems? Like if you want to do a lot of charms or, um, uh, what's it, what are they called? What's this does? Uh, pins, like wood pins. So then I ordered clear sticker paper. So at this point, this whole experiment is done, but I have, I have bought some, UV resin and some clear sticker paper and we're gonna we're gonna keep it going we're gonna keep trying um to figure it out how to do it uh the stamps I'm gonna engrave tonight uh, finally <laughs> and I have a comic video that I finally edited like here I'll show you like I edited the shit out of it so you'll see how good yes okay so here's the edited comic video so I like to edit out the background so it, like you focus more on the drawing and not like the program. Um, 
I don't know about you guys, but I like never watch people really do speed paints anymore because of this problem. Like the zooming in, the zooming out, the fucking just seeing mo most of the screen being taken up by the goddamn program window instead of the actual drawing, you know? So I know it's like kind of pointless, but like aesthetically, I think it looks way better. And it just makes me feel proud of making the videos like this. Um, but yeah, uh, it takes time to like do all the crops and edits because like, I don't know if you can see just like how many crops that is, but it's a lot. It takes me about 30 minutes to do it. Um, and then I also have to do the audio tonight and then I have to do the thumbnail. I haven't decided what I want the topic to even be about, but I I'll figure it out. Um, but... Yeah, it's not been a very successful day. <laughs> I just feel so stupid because, like, all the shit I was working on has not worked out whatsoever. And it was raining all the time. It is, it's just, like, I just feel super unproductive this week. Unsurprising. Do I ever feel productive? No. Um, especially lately because I've been a piece of shit. So I got this at Michael's. <laughs> I'm going to hang it up on the wall. Put it right there. Little wood coffin. Anyways, I'm gonna call it a video. <sighs> bye bye. Okay, I thought that was the last clip. This will be the last clip. So I just wanted to show you guys. Um, I bought these metal business cards that you can uh, laser engrave. Um, and check it out. Yeah. So that's the engraving. It took me a while to get the settings right, but yeah.